Welcome to the team, coach. We'd like to get you up and running with play as quickly as possible. This short video will guide you through your first few steps with your account. We'll be covering how to create your team, how to set up your game schedule, and how to upload game video. Let's get started by creating your team. From your home screen, click the Profile menu option to view your profile page. On the Profile page, click the Add Team button. Type the name of your team in the search box that appears and check to see if an athlete or fan may already have entered it. If the team exists, click the name to claim it as yours. If the search doesn't find the team, you'll need to create it. Click the Can't Find Your Team link at the right of the light box. Enter your team name. If there may be multiple teams in your town or school sharing the same base name, we recommend including the sport, player gender, and age group in the official team name to help users find the right one. Once you've got the team name set up, enter the rest of the team information. If there's not an exact match in either jersey color or age group, pick the closest one. Finally, click Save. As a coach, you can have more than one team, so go ahead and create each of the teams you're coaching. Back on your profile page, you'll see your newly created team. You can click an existing team to bring up its details and edit them if you need to. Next, let's create your first game event. Click the Events link in the Navigation menu. On the Events page, click the Add Event button. If you have video from a recent game, create an event for that game now so you can follow along and upload the video in the next step. In the Add Event lightbox, start typing the home team's name and select the correct choice from the list that drops down. Similarly, select the away team. If you can't find your opposing team, they may not be using play, so go ahead and create the team just as you did with your own team. Click the Can't Find Home Team or Can't Find Away Team link and enter the team details. Back in the Add Event lightbox, select the game location or leave it as to be determined, set the game date and time, and click Save when you're done. You will see the game appear either in the Recent or Future tab of the Events page. Now that you have your first event set up, let's upload game video for it. You can stream video live to play from our iPhone app, but for this demonstration, we'll be uploading a video file, like from your camera reel or a GoPro-type device. Click the Upload Video icon in the top left of the screen. You'll be asked to select which game you want to upload video for. You can choose among existing events, or you can create a new game on the spot. We'll choose the event we just created and click Select. Click the Browse link to navigate to the folder holding your game video file, or you can drag a video file icon from your desktop into the Upload box. Once the transfer starts, you can click the Done button and the upload will continue in the background. The status bar at the bottom of the screen will let you know how the file transfer is progressing. There may be a brief delay before the clips become available as the video file is processed or if other users are in line ahead of you. Once processing is complete, you'll find your new clips in your Homepage Gallery tab and in the details under the event you uploaded to. Play offers many other features you'll have fun exploring and using, but these basics will get you started. Have fun, and thanks for using Play.